us fading away, we had to regroup, you know, take our time and get the pay up a set and hash one. It's a great team, well, well coached, well prepared, and we had to do a few things to kind of mix them up. So the second half was detailed as it as as you've seen, we're down by nine. So just told these young men to have the patience of Joe. Um, be ready and willing to do whatever is necessary to execute one basket at a time. And so we had some big rebounds and some big shots and some stops. So that's just a brief synopsis of what I said. The floor is now open for additional comments or questions. Please direct your questions to the student athletes first and then the coach. Dave, you had 30 well, I mean, obviously double double and a couple more than uh, triple double. But what was working for you? Um, I was just telling you to bring down. All my teammates told me to bring down. That was that was really important. So, but what have you been preaching to them all day? When you have thirty rebounds for an entire <coughs> team with so little on one player. Um, just telling him to to rebound the basketball with two hands protected. And um, stop turning the basketball over. <laughs> uh, so that's our, that's our biggest thing. And I see that he had 40 in the day, but we may be able to overlook that. He did what we asked him. Coach, did you or David realize that he was approaching 30 rebounds? Yeah. Or did you look at the stat sheet and just be surprised? Huh? I, I knew I had 10 at half time. I thought I had like 20 or 30. Yeah. Yeah. The only thing I was concentrating on him rebounding with two hands, making some layups, and you C three four eleven, and um, that was my concentration of what I wanted him to be, you know, to look at. So um, didn't really pay it any attention until someone told me after the game. Uh, Cameron, I know, I know the first time you played this game, it wasn't much of a game, and then they shot the lights up. But right from the start, I mean, you, you had a couple of jams early. It, it seemed like there was a different approach, a different attitude uh, toward this game. I know it's a bigger stage. Here. What do you think? I mean, what, what was the, the mentality coming into this game? I just felt like we came out attacking and we punched over the mouth first, and I wasn't able to get a couple more. How about you, Dick? What, what did you think? Uh, we definitely were uh, aggressive early, <coughs> even though we did get a little lax. Um, that's why I think we got him to go to the show. But they're definitely a great team. Why, why do you think you know it became a close game? Yeah. That, I mean, what what changed? What was wrong? As coach said, we got a little lax, and uh, one we had a little stress when we weren't executing. And uh, Mark and I said to coach, let's do it. Yes. Well, this is a question for Dave. Um, where did Doc get the opportunity to sit the climb back in the game after Doc got down in the second half of round? He's a great coach. He knew what he could do about everything was going wrong. And, I corrected, I adjusted, it to be great. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Specifically, you know, did it happen or was this a mindset? Or? Uh, mindset, definitely. Mindset. We definitely have to play it. We definitely have to play it. So we just definitely have to change that mindset. Coach, this is obviously familiar territory for you guys advancing in this moment and this particular venue. What's the mentality going into tomorrow and the potential of that? Um, just, just the same thing preparation. Um, starting tonight, um, making sure we get the the rest, uh, get hydrated, and making sure that the guys, um, once we do our scout report based on who wins the, the following game that we play, um, we just have to prepare. Um, so it's a win in advance. There's nothing um, spectacular. We've been blessed to be here before. Um, being here is not um, just the only thing that we want to do. Um, everybody's invited to the Seattle Bay. It's not like the old days when they left people out. Everybody's here. We want to be here in advance. We want to take advantage of this opportunity that's presented to us. Are there any further questions on the floor? This concludes this session of our post game wrap up. We would like to thank you all for joining us and we wish you the best of luck on your next round of the tournament. Thank you.